Hey, good evening, everybody. So real quick, very quick, hopefully, um, I really wanted to just um, explain the importance of why. Why should we even follow the word of God? Why? What's the big deal? Why can I not do it? I mean, what harm is it, right? But in order for you to understand the why, you have to be able to um and put yourself in the position of a parent. You have to be able to put yourself in the position of a mentor, okay? So let's say you are parenting or mentoring a young child, okay? And this young child is like just acting a hot mess, okay? Uh, rebelling against you, not listening to you, and not listening to the teachers, just going all the way around, just just not listening to anybody, okay? And in their mind, they think that they can... um do whatever they want, whatever they please, okay? No matter what, who cares? Um, if they continue in that uh, on that path and they get older and still continue on that, that child's going to end up in jail or, or even worse, you know, in prison or even worse, really dead, truly, okay? Because they're now on a path leading to death. They're now on a path leading to destruction, okay? But you as a parent, you as a mentor, your job is to correct. Your job is to guide that person, guide that child on the path to success, right? On the path, yeah, to success, right? So otherwise, you know, you wouldn't be a good mentor or a good parent you know what I mean so um put yourself in the position of God well <laughs> now just kind of relate that back to God okay <laughs> God sends his followers to tell any one of his creation the disobedient disobedient um hey Turn back. You are currently on a road to destruction. You are currently on the road to death right now. You have to turn back toward me because if you turn back toward me, you are automatically placed on the road to life leading to everlasting life because this world it's not just this world after we, we all pass away from this world we are we enter into eternity and you are either going to spend an eternity with God life or an eternity apart from God which is death okay um, and you will be very very alive in both you know you'll be you'll be feeling it all okay so that is what God does. That is the purpose of the word. It's an instruction. God, what God does is, like I said, he'll He'll point all of us back to what he already has told us, all of the guide, all of the instruction, which is written in the Bible. And if you follow him by following his word, um, and, you know, of course, having that connection, following his word, then you will then be placed on the path that's leading to life, that's leading to purpose, you know, that's that's leading to fulfillment in this life, you know, apart from death, you know. But if you decide to rebel, if I decide to rebel, then we are now, um, I'm distracted, my mom's here. <laughs> hey, mama. <laughs> we are now on the path to um, death, okay? We've voluntarily taken ourselves off of the path to life because we did not want to listen to God and decided to do things our own way. Just like that child who uh, thought that, you know, hey, I can do whatever I want. I can, I don't have to listen to anybody. Uh-uh, y'all. Uh-uh. It's just, it's the same way, okay? Um, I don't want to ramble, especially on something so very important. Um, but if you have any questions, please comment down below or uh, you can email me, uh, cynt8713 at gmail.com. And I'll be more than happy to talk to you about this thing called repentance. Repentance is a 100 and it's, it's a mental change of mind. Like, oh, snap, the way that I am headed, it is toward death. It is toward destruction. Shoot, I guess I'm going to need to turn 180 degrees around back to life, which is God through Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ actually is life. You have to turn to Jesus, okay, and say, Lord, make him your Lord, meaning Okay, I want to do whatever you say, because I know that the words that come out of your mouth, Jesus, are, it's my guide, it's my instruction, it's the way to everlasting life.